news with Tom and Leif. Thanks Tom. Our top story today concerns a man in Aberdeen who is stuck in a bin. Well Leif, his name was William and he was looking for his hat. So he thought a good place to start was the bin. That's how he got his head stuck. Back to you Leif. The man who's aged 53 was nicknamed Bucket Hyde by his friends. They tried to pull him out but unfortunately he got stuck by his ears. Our next story concerns a Whitstable mum in custard shortage, Tom. Tell me more. There is a custard shortage in Whitstable. This is an absolute disaster. What do you think, Leif? Well, Jules Serkin, who has been described as a keen baker, aged 43, went to her local co-op, but there was none there, not even the off-brand. You know where she needed to go, Leif? Where's that? Waitrose. I agree. Last week we had several evocative stories. One story surrounded the contentious issue of pigeon rights. Mr. Pedro has stated, honestly outraged that pigeons are allowed to carry out this form of vandalism without consequence. The local authorities should lock these creatures away. That's not very nice, Pedro. Speaking of last week's stories, we had a Tesco-wide conspiracy where they were getting rid of organic power jokes. We now go to Leif Live at Waitrose, where he investigates whether there are organic power jokes at Waitrose. Leif. Thanks, Tom. I'm here in Waitrose and you can clearly see Irish organic jumbo oats. They're not hiding them here. Look, in front of the crisps, right there. It's healthy, it's jumbo, not just normal. This isn't Tesco's, Tom, it's Waitrose. Good to hear, Leif. Now we go to Jenny Han- Oh, oh, Leif's coming back in now. Leif, Leif, what are you saying? It's Tesco's, Tom. They found me. Gonna have to jump the gate. 